That major switch up in the race for the presidency, Joe Biden announcing he is ending his campaign. As of right now, the only Democrat to throw their hat into the race is Vice President Kamala Harris. Cardio 13 investigator Michael Lagerwell is live in downtown Colorado Springs after speaking with voters about what this change means for their vote. Michael. Now, some voters, it, it's been a mixed bag. Some voters told me the idea of electing VP Kamala Harris this November has re-energized them to get out to the ballot box. Now, others tell me the switch up doesn't do much for them. Democratic voters are riding high today. This after Vice President Kamala Harris announced her intention to secure the Democratic nomination for president. I'm excited to vote for her. I think she's going to do an excellent job, and I'm excited she is the nominee. That excitement led donors to pour in $81 million into the Harris campaign coffers in less than 24 hours, a presidential record. We've seen a huge influx of volunteer requests. But not everyone is swept up in the Harris wave. I'm leaning towards voting for her, but I'm also interested in seeing kind of how the next few months go and how good of a candidate she is because I feel like uh, we haven't really seen her in the spotlight a whole lot. Does that change how you, you think you're going to vote this November? I don't think it changes it. I think, again, it just brings some more excitement and energy to that side of things. On the other side of the party lines, local Republicans are saying there isn't unity in the Democratic Party. El Paso County GOP Chair Roman Vicky Tonkins told KRDO 13 the Democrats are in total disarray. It will be interesting to see what happens at the DNC. Follow the money, honey. Republicans will win big in 2024. No, no one brought any other names up to me today Vice President as who Harris. would excite them more for Dem Right, no one brought any other names up to me for who would excite them for a uh, Democratic nominee. Now, nationally, looking more across the country, West Virginia Senator Joe Manchin has floated the idea of a Democratic run at the Democratic nomination, but he would have to rejoin the party first. Reporting live from downtown Colorado Springs, Michael Lagerwell, KRDO 13.